All right, it's time to work on the uh, figure of Noah. And uh, I'm not going to make him overly muscular, but uh, for a man that was in his 400 years of life, when he's getting ready to start uh, the uh, arc, you would guess that after a lifetime of hard work and uh, on a farm, which I'm sure he had, he wasn't a shipbuilder. He uh, kind of had to change his profession. Time to play with some clay. Now I understand there are a lot of people who are skeptical of uh, the ark and the flood and all that stuff. And that's, I think, primarily because of uh, the child's, children's magazines or books that had silly cartoon drawings of the ark, which I'm going to show you here, one of them. It, I mean, I can't really blame people for having been brainwashed into thinking that it's... Uh, fairy tale because of things like that. I'm going to put up a couple pictures from a, a couple people and I'll put their name up here of uh, the Ark. They went and visited it and this is a view from the bow of the ship and uh, of the Ark. And just look at the immense size of that thing. That was no cartoon. boat. It was uh, a serious undertaking that uh, probably took close to a hundred years to build. And you can see why it would take that long. Okay, I'm gonna put his head... I was gonna do a, a drapery over his head, but I don't think I'm going to. I really like that one sketch with the uh, wrap around the guy's head. And uh, I would think that he'd want something to be on his head that uh, would stop sweat from rolling into his uh, eyeballs. And so I'm just, I'm just guessing. I mean, I'm, all this is assumption. Do a whole lot of a something in <laughs> what I sculpt, and uh, I really don't know. So anyway, I'm just going to continue working on this and uh, let it lead me where it leads me. What I'm trying to do is uh, have his hair coming up from under the uh, wrap. That's what I'm trying to do.
I want to make it look like disheveled hair. But I want to be careful not to make it too complicated to where it can't be cast. And this may not work out, so I may just take it all off again. But I want to try it. I've got something in my head that I see. Now, whether I can transfer it from my brain to my clay is a whole different thing. See, I'm thinking about having the hair coming out from underneath the uh, wrap as well. I'm going to go ahead and put his beard on. What I'm doing is just building the structure of this beard. <laughs> Trying to decide what kind of clothes to put on them. I'm just sketching in the hand right now. I just want to see what it looks like. The possibilities. Maybe have the hair of his beard flowing over the fingers. I'm liking this a lot.
I think that's going to turn out pretty good. I was a little worried about it last night. Whether I should stop this or keep going on it. I think I'm going to keep going on it. I think it's just interesting enough that uh, it's, it's, it's worthwhile trying and sticking with. Whether you believe in them or not, it makes a nice piece of art. If I can do it the way I see it in my head right now. I might take that down just a little bit. All right, everybody. Have a great night. I'll see you next time. Yeah, I think that... Uh, wrap around his head was per perfect it was sweatband you might say all right good night if you like this video please like and subscribe to my channel it really would help me also check out the link below this video it will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting Good night, everybody.